Thanks for joining me on Line of Meteorologist Rod Cowan as we take a look at New Year's Eve, rounding out 2018 on a soggy note, that's for sure. Rain will arrive right around noon. Some location, maybe the late morning, we'll track that hour by hour here in just a minute. Rain will be heavy at times, and we're talking a half an inch to possibly three quarters of an inch or even locally close to an inch of rain. As we take a look at our hour by hour model, notice how those clear skies become cloudy as we get into the early morning hours of Monday. Now we jump ahead to right around 10, 1030. You start to see the rain pushing in towards Salem and towards Lisbon, down towards Selineville, East Liverpool, southern portions of Columbiana County. Now an hour, hour and a half later, that pushes up towards the north, gets everybody involved as we get into the late afternoon hours. You notice how the rain comes a little heavy Heavier. Temperatures start to rise and look at these gusty winds. So we're going to have warm temperatures, gusty winds, and look at this. Temperatures getting into the 50s as a second round of rain pushes through the area. So our high temperatures are going to come very late in the day. We're going to go from the 30s to the 40s and end up in the upper 50s by 9 o'clock. Now we'll jump ahead to right around midnight. The last bit of rain pushes all the way into Pennsylvania, so maybe over towards Grove City, uh, south, southern portions of Mercer there, down towards East Palestine. East Liverpool, maybe just an isolated shower. But as you can see, back towards Trumbull County, Mahoning County, just mainly cloudy skies. We jump ahead into Tuesday. Notice how these temperatures go from the mid 30s down into the low 30s throughout the day. So it could be a little bit of rain, could be a little snow, and that will be on the light side for both of those. As we take a look at Wednesday, we'll call it partly cloudy to mostly cloudy with temperatures getting back into the mid 30s. So for tonight, overnight lows in the upper 20s. Temperatures will just continue to rise throughout the day. Now, as we go through most of the day, it'll be in the 30s in the morning, the 40s in the afternoon, and then eventually, as we get into the evening hours, then we'll get into the mid and upper 50s. Here's your day planner for tomorrow. You notice those 30s at 9 a.m., just cloudy skies. Rain starts to move in the area at noon, and then by 3 o'clock, we're at 50 degrees with those occasional rain showers, which could be heavy at times. Now we'll take a look at your next three days. We warm up to 56, so right around midnight, temperatures are going to be in the mid-50s. That'll be the high on Tuesday officially, but through the day on Tuesday, we're going to see those temperatures falling. Chance of rain or snow dropping down into the upper 20s by Wednesday morning. Now we'll take a look at your next seven days.